We're here today to demonstrate proper techniques for performing flat glass film installation on large windows using the splice method. When you come across a window that is over five feet in width and height, you'll need to use the splicing method to install the film. It's best to find a place to hide the splice, such as behind the curtains or up under the shades. Now we'll help you get a visual understanding of the steps involved in splicing. The most important thing to remember when creating rough cut splice patterns for large windows is to use the same factory edge to overlap the films. The film is metalized, so the color may not be uniform across the roll. By matching the same factory edge, the colors will match where the films meet. Take the width and length measurements of your first splice, insert your knife through the box at the desired width, then lay your tape out on the floor to the desired length. As you pull the film from the box, the knife will cut the film at the proper width. Roll your splice piece towards the box of film, liner side in. Cut the film from the box and mark the roll as splice number one. Adjust the knife in the box to the width of the second splice. Once it is pulled to the desired length, cut the film from the box. Roll the film from the edge closest to the box with the liner side in. Mark it as splice number two and set aside the two marked rolls. Once your rough cut rolls are prepared and the window and frame are cleaned, you can move forward with the installation and final trim of the spliced film patterns. Remove the liner of the first splice and film adhesive. Install your first rough cut pattern with the factory edge towards the middle of the window, lined up with the marks that you put on the frame. Be sure to allow a half to one inch overlap to allow for the splice. Squeegee and trim the three sides as needed. Remove the liner on your second rough cut pattern. Spray the adhesive and install, overlapping your mark on the frame by half to one inch. Squeegee and trim the three sides as needed. Now we'll cut the splice. Use your knife with a new sharp blade and begin your splice. Go as far as you can comfortably, then reposition the straight edge if necessary and continue your splice cut in a straight line. Remove the top layer of film scrap. Then carefully peel back the corner of the pattern with scrap under it. Gently peel out the scrap and simultaneously mist across the splice while pulling out the scrap. Squeegee over the splice gently, removing any water. Be careful not to catch the splice and crash or tear the film while squeegeeing. Follow the squeegee splice pattern shown here. Wrap a paper towel around your five-way tool. Go over the entire window, bumping the gaskets and absorbing the excess water. Gently clean the window. 